everybody, this is Ostuni. Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Fighters. And it is time to just keep it going, I guess. Uh, last time we were actually properly introduced to Android 21. And this time we're apparently going to try and rescue Vegeta. So let's go ahead and start this up. I um, actually decided to make my... Um, make my first um, person on my party Piccolo because Piccolo is a character that I would not mind actually learning a little bit more how to play as considering he is uh, one of my favorite um, characters that isn't um, just uh, like the be all end all as like power scale and everything like that. What can I do with you? Okay. Okay. Alright, I, I guess that works. Ooh, I gotcha. Ooh, not bad. All right, cool. Let's see, and next, Yamcha. And... Let's see, I think it's kind of disappointing, though, that, like, that's all that Piccolo gets for um, his finisher is the light grenade. No offense to the actual move or anything like that, but I think I've only seen Piccolo use it a grand total of once. Like, I think he should have, um, like, had the special beam cannon actually be, like, his ultimate finisher. Because that's what he's really known for. But I, don't get me wrong, though, since the special beam cannon isn't here, it's definitely, uh, it's definitely good that's there. So let's just keep it going. Alright, we're just gonna kinda mosey around all these people because I really want to get the story mode done for a multitude of reasons. Um, I want to be able to actually cover mod content eventually for you guys and I want to have um, Android 21 unlocked because I'm pretty sure that there will be mods somehow pertaining to her. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to beat these clones asses. Oh, I gotcha. Chopped you. Give you a nice little brain shot. There's no escape. Hell's over Guess that works. Alright. Yeah, not a bad little combo. Oops. There we go. Okay. Sometimes button mashing actually does work in this game, believe it or not. And... And... Yeah. How about that? Yeah! Get out of here. Piccolo don't like your bullshit no more. Alright. So there we go. That's that. Everybody's leveling up. Looking good. Looking good. I'm probably gonna replace uh, Majin Buu with uh, Vegeta, honestly. Alright. Ooh! Ginyu! Awesome! You get to see funny interactions with Ginyu. And the rest of the Ginyu Force, more than likely. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. You know, like, you know what, Funko, you know what you need to do? A five-pack, um, little Funko, uh, pop of a certain force hmm. that's, that's led by Ginyu. Vegeta should be close by. Just saying. He's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh, really? Hey, look over there. Yep, Vegeta. oh, just... 
Oh, fuck that. Who's there? Yeah, it's us. Well, well. If it isn't the welcome wagon. Indeed. Ah, and I was so close to. I wanted you off this impertinent oh. prince. Before that woman could turn him into an old dirt. What is he talking about? Oh, so he's already seen oh, it. That wouldn't change your beautiful fate as the main cause, would it? Oh. In fact, I may as well exterminate all of you now! Okay. Allow your humble servant to assist. Yeah! Yeah! Burr! Jace! Gudo! Captain Gudo! Oh, the kid! Oh, Gudo boss! Fuck yeah! Why does it have to make me so? The more awkward? things change, the more they stay the same, huh? And they do this, um. Why again? Because it's badass something you wouldn't fucking know about Goku with your silver ass hair. Hmm? Um, well, impressive. Oh, I'm, I'm Master Ultra Instinct Goku. My hair turns white and I become uh, Dante from Don't Make Cry. Uh, it's it's whatever for me. Alright then, you sh you can go ahead and try, you f f sassy bitch, but it's always gonna end the same, me stomping you into a fucking mud pile, piece of garbage. That was a cool thing to say, wasn't it? I think so too. Right, here we go, Piccolo gonna make you his bitch. Just like he did in the fight whenever um, it was uh, you versus him in your second floor, Frieza. Yeah! Just slam! Just chop! Just soloing your ass. All right, Super Saiyan Vegeta is now playable, so definitely got a new party member. Cause uh, no offense, Majin Buu, but uh, no, just no. You just hanging out, Vegeta's. Ooh. I can see now why Cell was struggling so much. You have done quite well mm. to tap into this much power. Sorry, Frieza. <laughs> Looks like you're the one that's going to be doing the dying today. But before we blast you into microscopic pieces, you're going to tell us something. Whoa. Oh, pray tell. When you said we'd be that woman's main course, what did you mean? Because as I see it, Android 21 is just trying to kill us. <laughs> oh. Very well. I suppose I should reward you for that stimulating scuffle. No, Lord Frieza. There's no need to divulge information to the enemy. Is Frieza about to be the voice of reason? No need to worry. I merely want to fan the flame of fear that is to consume them. Oh, okay. Well, maybe not. That woman. You refer to her as Android 21, if I am not mistaken. She fully devours warriors, which adds their strength to hers. It's a simply remarkable process. Kidding! I'm serious. She turns the victims into I'm serious. <laughs> Just crude, if you want my opinion. But who has she devoured so far, if anybody? I see. So that's what her scheme is. Yeah, you still haven't explained that, though. Who has she devoured? Ish. I mean, talk about bizarre. That's not too different from Cell or Boo. Well then, if that's the case, we're pretty lucky to have found these guys before Android 21 could gobble them down. 
Oh, stop all your silly nonsense. I won't become noisy in 21. More trouble oh. before you crater. Think you can get away from us, Frieza? <laughs> I want my own. Oh yeah, that's right. Goldo can actually uh, be of use. Damn it. Huh, so he is running away. So they know that uh, they don't really have that much time to do, you know, anything worthwhile, really. So I guess that's good-ish. Yeah, we got Vegeta though. Jeez. I see. A lot has happened while I was out. Still, letting Frieza mm. slither away like that proves you're nothing but soft. Ooh. You were made painfully aware of Guldo's power when you fought him on Namek. That's right. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. <sighs> Vegeta, I don't think you have room to talk <laughs> right now. Oh. While you were sleeping like a Saiyan log, everyone was out fighting for the world. That's right. <laughs> Maybe we could just save the marital squabbles for later, huh? Yeah. I know, I know, you're right. It's been some time since 21 flew off. All right. Yeah. And if what Frieza said is true, 21 should be a lot stronger by now. But who has she been fucking eating? That's right. It's high time you pull the plug on that oversized blender. Wait. Has she been eating the clones? Yeah. Hmm. But we can't get a fix on 21's power. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. It doesn't right. matter how strong 21 gets. I'm sending her to the trash compactor. <sighs> there he goes again. Oh, God, Volna. Why you gotta really, do that Vegeta? One? You were napping this whole time. You've never seen Android 21 in action. Kakarot! Just shut it! Look, we're glad you're on board, Vegeta. But you'd better get used to linking before taking on 21. That's right. Remember, without linking, we are utterly powerless. <laughs> That's certainly no way to fight. We don't know where the waves are coming from. We we'll just have to accept it. All right. <laughs> okay, okay. Settle down, everyone. And that goes for you too, Vegeta. Piccolo's the one who saved your butt when Frieza was about to fry you. That's right. I think you owe him some thanks. Oh, he acted on his own. I don't recall asking for help. Right. Oh, is that how it is? Well, good. Because the thought of being thanked by you makes me want to hurl. Oh. Wh what was that? <laughs> nice comeback, Vegeta. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. So, uh, this is just Dragon Ball Roasts, basically, game the game. <laughs> Let's clean up the baddies that we know are out there already. All right. We can't afford to let 21 chomp them down and then get even stronger. Good thinking. And fighting those clones, that would be some good link practice, too. The very right. thought of fighting with someone else in my body is just sickening. But I'll let it slide this once. Okay. Well, good to have you on the team, Burjata. Now I saved. Super Saiyan Vegeta is now available. Ooh, somebody else needs saving? Who? Ooh. Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks. I wouldn't mind trying him out, I guess. I don't know. Let's see. Alright, let's edit the team. Alright. I'll actually do it in this order. Whoop. Eh. There we go. And there we go. Okay. So let's go ahead and... Wait a minute. So this is just... Regular ass Frieza? That's so weird. But I'll uh, go down there. Wait a minute. And then regular cell as well. I'm gonna take a look and see what these uh these are. Let's see. Alright. So we'll actually be uh Helping out a uh, go tanks no matter what we do. So that'll be good. Quite surprised. Really? Never thought you'd be willing to partner up with anyone. He's not. <laughs> you know, if I were at my full power, I wouldn't need you here, so don't make me regret it. Oh. Just making the best of what is a bad situation. Alright. Still, I feel like the old Vegeta would have just fought alone anyway. 
<laughs> God, I like this banter. But know this. If you start holding me back, I'm not going to stick my neck out for you. Right. Trust me, I feel the same way. Mm -hmm. oh, try not to get in my way, right? Oh. Let's do this, Vegeta. <laughs> I don't need you to tell me that. God, these two would be like bro bros, like if they just trade together. Imagine how much stronger, particularly Piccolo would get, and probably how many interesting things Vegeta could come up with if they trade together, like as far as techniques go. That would be an interesting thing to see. Like, as they do kind of have, like, very serious personalities. And I see someone's fired up. Ooh, gotcha. Punched you. Right in the dick. Alright, that's right, that's another Uh oh, no! I know that that song is awesome, but I can't play it on here. But I do, um, that is a big difference between, uh, Blue and, uh, regular, uh, Vegeta. Is that, um, Big Bang Attack is a super for, um, regular Vegeta, while it is a regular move for, um, for, uh, Blue Vegeta. Well, not really a regular move, but, like, it doesn't consume, like, the super gauge, if you guys know what I mean. I think that, uh, Blue Vegeta is, like, I think another difference is that Blue Vegeta is much more of a technical character because a lot of his moves require a lot more of a uh, setup, it seems. Like, particularly his Gallic Gun, it always fires up, like, at an angle. So, I think that it's definitely said, like, hey, Vegeta's good and everything, but uh, what you want to do is you want to, you know, actually prep yourself and get yourself in the right position in order to do this. Oh, well, hello there. It's the boys and they're hurt. Yeah. You gotta get them back to Bulma. Goku, look, an enemy. Ooh, it's clone Jeeps. It looks like he's in the mood to let us go without a fight. No, he doesn't. Our only chance is to take him out. Okay, we're well, to do it. Gotta take down clone Jeeps and save Trucks and Goten, who collectively make up Gotenks, which is much more useful. Right here we go. Gonna do the thing. All right. And wow! Oh, okay. Ah, okay, I got a combo. I got a, I got a little bit of a combo going on with Jeets now. Cool. This part of the game is incredibly easy. I guess they're just kind of string this along for a little bit. All right, everybody's at least at level 10 now, so I guess that's good, but I haven't really noticed um, level really playing any factor in determining whether these battles can be won or lost. Uh, yeah, uh, Trunks! Uh, what's everyone doing here? Oh, Trunks! I'm so glad you're okay. Well, what about fucking what Goten? What is this place? And where's Gohan? Oh, hey, Piccolo. Listen yeah. up, you two. I have to explain something. Okay. 
and they're not gonna understand. What this all means is that without the link, we can't fight. Right. What? So some creepy stranger is gonna live in my body? No way, not uh Hey, I don't really want to be in a kid's body either, so... Because that's kind of frowned upon. We don't need that, right, Goten? All we have to do is fuse, and we'll be able to fight for sure. Ha! Uh -huh. I'm with you, Trunks. Let's show them how strong we've become. Okay, you ready? Yep. All right. Shun! Yeah! All right, cool. Now what moves should I perform? Oh, I know. Here goes. Charging Ultra Boo Boo Poly Ball. Get it. Oh, I don't anyone to play the ball. <laughs> Aw, but I really wanted to show you, Piccolo. Maybe something a bit less awesome would be better. We are on a plane after all. Miracle Punch! Uh-huh. <laughs> I told you already. Oh, yep. You need to have a link first. Without one, you can't even fly. It's that simple. No, uh watch this. Time to fly. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> fly. I said fly. Dang it. Come on. Fly. <laughs> like a bird. Piccolo, what's going on? He just You're wasting told your you. energy. You have to link. Accept it. Aw, seriously? Right. Cool. So now we got go tanks. I guess that's okay. Well, it's... Ooh, Super Saiyan, um... Let's see, a link event has been triggered. Check it out on the edit team or art gallery. Let's see. Edit team. Okay, phase one. All right, let's see what this is. So, I can tell this is your first fight, eh? Hey, not really. there's no need to be so tense. Just watch your opponent, and you'll see mm -hmm. the next move will naturally come to you. Oh, like, um, some form that you know? Like Ultra Instinct? Uh, or AKA laziness? You do that, it'll almost be like your body's on cruise control. <laughs> He's just really referencing fucking you Ultra Instinct. You are able to make this work? Hmm. I never thought about that. Uh, hmm. We'll get to it when we get to it. Oh, really? Hey, partner. I'm looking forward to fighting you. Okay. That's cool. I'd like to cheer John if I were to go, I guess. Okay, let's just, uh... Let's just try this fight. This'll... This'll be interesting. Because this is the first time that I think, um, like, Cell or Frieza have been available to fight, like, the real ones. Um, and they haven't been tied to, like, a cutscene slash story that- Oh, well, maybe. Maybe I was wrong. I don't care much for that woman, though. I suppose I should offer my thanks. After all, but she has given what? me the perfect opportunity to dispose of the two of you rejects. <laughs> huh. Dispose of us? I was thinking the same thing about you. Ooh. I can finally crush you with my two bare hands. That's right. Very well, then, if you wish to die that badly. Wait okay. a sec! What? what do you want? <laughs> what the fuck face is that, Goku? What is that? <laughs> he looks so fucking mad. Stay out of this! Who says you get to fight first, Vegeta? Oh, it's rock, paper, fair. scissors. Nobody cares! Quit bothering me! Oh, God, this would be funny if they were just like, hmm, I wonder who fights first. I know we'll fuse and both of us get to you fight. The <laughs> and then Freeze is just like, wait a minute, watch. Yeah, well, sorry about that, but if you'll remember, I didn't have much of a Je choice. Whatever, just stay out of my way. Jesus, we'll Goku, with your even. funny faces. Well, technically, I saved you earlier, so aren't we already even? When you were knocked out and Frieza tried to Jesus. attack you, I blocked the attack and saved you. Shut up! Why do yeah. you always bring that up? Now, if you're done trying to steal my moment of glory, I have a fight to get to. <laughs> Frieza's getting a little Jeez, mad. Jeez, no need to be so moody, Vegeta. Just let me fight Frieza for a little bit, okay? Cool? A bit? Do I look stupid? Just let me fight! <laughs> That is enough! You oh. have some nerve making me listen to this juvenile squabbling! But all right. That's something I you seriously insist. cannot stand about the two of you mindless monkeys. All if right. you two want yeah, to fight yeah. me so badly, 
Then I'll just destroy you both at the same time. Oh. I'll crush the two of you with my bare hands. So are we in this team by default? Goku and Vegeta? Or do we have our own actual party? Oh, okay. Well, technically we already had Goku and Vegeta on the same team. So I guess that's kind of why. So let's go ahead and do this. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm switching into uh oh cool, I already have Vegeta. You're strong enough to handle this. Oh dang it, Zamasu pop fell down. I'll show you what I mean by that in just a second. Oh, Jesus. Really? But yeah, what I was uh, referring to was a uh, little Zamasu pop fell down because his because his uh, feet are kind of weird. I don't know why that is. Like I've been getting rotten luck with uh, some pops lately. Like their feet are kind of mismatched and everything. But yeah, that's neither here nor there. I still I still love all my little pops. Oh, so you want to get in my way? Well, guess what? We're gonna have to actually cut it right here because it's. It's a little bit of a um, longer episode, but it ain't too bad. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You know when the next episode is coming out. And question of the day for you guys. If you guys could pick a character to change a super or ultimate move of, who would it be? Why do you want to change it? And how would you change it? Is it like a complete change to a different move? Would it be how the move is actually utilized? Would it be the amount of damage it does? Just all those details. Whatever it is you think would be worthy of a redo of a move on a character. Like, let me know in the comments below. I think this would be an interesting little discussion, because like I said, I would have liked for, um, like, Piccolo's ultimate ability to be Special Beam Cannon. I thought that would have been pretty cool. And uh, maybe like Renee taking like one of those uh, kind of super spots. Like, I think that would be uh, pretty good. But thank you guys for watching. This is Sunny. Signing off. Yeah.